Hi guys, today I have a bonus video for you just coming on to show you how I made this beautiful table using some Dollar Tree items. I would also appreciate if you could check out some of these awesome DIYs that I have on my channel. I will link them in the description box for you so you can go and check them out when you're done. Before we get started, if you're watching from Facebook and you'd like to give me a thumbs up, please click the three dots on the top right corner of your mobile device and then select open in YouTube. And from there you can give me a thumbs up or you can subscribe or you can leave me a comment I would love to hear from you guys so I'll be using two bowls from the Dollar Tree and I'm going to be using cardboard to line them so they can stay nice and sturdy so I'm just outlining the bowl on the cardboard so I can use my scissors to cut out the piece and you want to cut it inside of your mark so it can sit flush inside of the bowl And then I use my hot glue to go around the edges to hold it in place. And as you can see here, I'm leaving space for the lip. And I'm using my sharp blade to cut out the piece. And then for the one that I'm going to put on the bottom, I'm just going to use some rocks and attach them to my cardboard with my hot glue. And this will help the table to be sturdy. And I'm just gonna put a little piece of foam board inside of it before I put on the cardboard with the rocks. So in case they should fall off while I'm attaching it, it won't hit the bowl and break it. And then I'm just going to hold it in with my hot glue. And I didn't show you the PVC previously. I'm going to be using a 4 inch PVC and I'll spray paint it with my Rust-Oleum chrome spray paint and I gave it about two light coats and then I just place it on top of my bowl and make sure that it's centered so I'm just using my sharpie to mark out the space so I can apply my glue and I'll be using E6000 along with my hot glue and I'm making sure to keep the glue on the inside of my mark so it won't spill much and as you can see it's right along the rim of the base so for the next one I didn't need to mark it I just I just applied the glue and while you're watching I'll really appreciate a thumbs up it will help to grow my channel so I can continue to bring you weekly tutorials like this one and if you're new here and you'd like to see my weekly tutorials Please consider subscribing and select the post notification so you'll be among the first to know every Friday when I upload my new videos. For the top, I'm going to be using a mirror that I got from Michael's. It's a 12 inch mirror. You could also use a pizza pan, but I'm using a mirror since I already have one. And I just use my E6000 and my hot glue and put it in place. And it's as simple as that guys. That's it. Thank you very much for watching and please subscribe if you didn't subscribe as yet and please turn your bell notifications on so you can get notified every Friday when I upload my new videos. Please click on the screen to continue watching more of my videos.